This is another AliExpress package. So there's two wires in here, one to each one of these uh, brass clips. And according to the uh, labeling, there's a number 1185 right here. Now 1185 is a shielded conductor. So I'm hoping that this is two wire shielded. It's a five pin connector. I'm going to assume maybe that one of these five is ground. Now you can buy these with unshielded wire that are sold for battery testing or, or DC testing, ohmmeter, DC ohmmeter. But I want to use this with my DE5000, which sort of likes shielded wire. After all, it does test at uh, 100 kilohertz. And this is the way it was sold on AliExpress. Uh, $9.58, free shipping, and 15-day delivery on orders over $5. This is an AliExpress package. No, it's not. This is a uh, an eBay delivery. And it's a uh, storage box for memory cards. I have two of these already. Extremely good quality. And this carrying case I should open it up it's like a wallet it can hold uh, micro SDs or full-size SDs cost ten dollars free delivery there's a few of them on eBay I bought it from this guy I believe this to be another eBay package. These are some uh, current shunt resistors pre-made for a Kelvin connection. These are 0.013% 7 watt resistors. 10 milliohms. And there are 10 of them. I believe it, they were being sold in lots of 10. Here's the four wire uh, power resistor. And a lot of 10 of these cost $5 plus $10 shipping. So they cost a buck 50 a piece, which is probably better or very close to the catalog price. Maybe it's better. And they were from somebody called Good Stuff 607607. 
on eBay. This is a package facilitated by eBay. I just nipped a wire. These are four AA battery holders. I had a problem with my meter and the batteries went bad, leaked. So this should be a replacement. Pretty sure it will nicely fit. Well, length is going to be a problem. I guess I'll have to force fit it there. You can see that it's slightly longer up here. I can get that meter back in operation. Here are the uh, two AA battery holders. Now I paid a ridiculous amount for these. Five dollars a piece. Uh, free shipping, but I did that because I was in a hurry to get the meter back together. I wasn't willing to wait from ch for a Chinese delivery. And I bought that on eBay from this guy. And this is a combined shipment from AliExpress. There's going to be a lot of stuff in here. Try to open it without damaging the contents. Alright, this is Ali at its best. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine packages somehow found their way into one AliExpress package in Jamaica, New York. Okay, we have a box. Ah, oh, some counterfeit coins. These are counterfeit wheat pennies. These are some rather large alligator clips. Not bad. Not good either. Uh, banana jack type connection. It's a really strong spring. The jaws do not line up and there's a piece of plastic, at least in this one, that's keeping the jaws from closing the entire way. Is that typical? No. That's a much better clamp. You can see about how big they are. They're they're rather large. They were cheap. Let's see, there were six pieces I must have ordered.
see, I see three blue ones, three white, red ones, three white ones, okay. So I ordered a, a mixture. I ordered a mixture of six pieces. And I must have got three of these. They look, the whole package cost less than ten dollars. Delivered. Another alley package. Fairly large. Okay, this is two package. Two packages of these Kelvin connectors with Kelvin uh, clips on one end and rather cheap banana plugs on the other end. But I want to see if this is uh, shielded wire. Although there's no provisions made for connection of a shield to anything. So it is shielded wire. Although of course the shields are not employed anywhere. So it's 18 gauge shielded wire without any termination for the shields. Shields just end at each end. They come in pairs. That is a red and black Kelvin lead. I don't know why this is all tangled up. It's supposed to be these shrink connectors on there. So we have a red and a black pair that is, comes into four way. And then would plug into a uh, uh, four wire measuring device but this would be DC only because the shields don't actually connect to anything so a lot of these Kelvin connectors are made for uh, resistance measurements so if they're used for resistors or they use DC for energizing the circuit if they're used for battery measurements, internal resistance, whatever, of course it's DC. But if you wanted to use this for an LCR meter, where L and C are measured with RF, or at least with AC, you would want shielded leads, but you would want a place to put the shield. And although these are shielded single conductor wires, there's nothing to connect to the shield. These are DC connections only. And these things cost $10 a piece, free shipping, oh no, they're dollar shipping. So there's $11 here. And you see they're advertised as LCR. But without a shield connection, I think there are only. Oh, <laughs> oh we, a friend of mine owns a Jeep. The only thing less reliable than a Jeep is a 1960s English-built automobile. <laughs> so I bought in a set of uh, a cob light on-off switch that you can connect to the battery. And there's enough to wire to travel around and see what tires flat or what part of the engine he needs to replace next. 
The aluminum is bent permanently there. Contains the electronics. And this thing cost a whopping $7.33. Uh, free shipping. It was sold as that. From AliExpress. Here's one from Ali. These are some panel connectors. I think they're GX12. Five pin. It actually unscrews. It's a strange way to build it. Keyed. There we go. I think they make these in 12, 16, and 20. And I guess it has something to do with the diameter. Looks like four of these assemblies. And here's the Alley Sellers page. GX125. They had them in two through uh, two pin through seven pin. And they cost 27 cents a connector set. Here are some more of those GX style sockets. I believe these are GX 16s maybe. And again this thing must unscrew. like that at all. So that means that if after you put your wires through here and you solder them onto this, the whole wire set and everything has to rotate as you screw this in. Here's this uh, G16 5 pin connector. It cost 80 cents for a pair of these. That is one assembly. Uh, free shipping. I was hoping to find something that would mate to this. So this 5-pin connector I had. See how they're laid out differently? In all other aspects they're identical. Except where this one has the screw-in connector body. This has a connector body held in by a screw. So if anybody has any ideas, these are the same diameter. But different pin configuration for 
They're both five pin socket and plug assemblies. So if anybody has any ideas, let me know. I appreciate it. Here's another one. And this is just some paired PVC insulated uh, red and black conductor wire. This costs six dollars. Well, seven dollars with shipping. I think this is the last alley package. Nope, one more. And this is another set of Kelvin, actually a pair of Kelvin clamps. These don't work at all. This is a nice little clamp. It's not very, doesn't feel very good, but it has two separate connections. But in this case, only one is used. The bottom. And not that. So it's not a real life four wire. It's just a, advertises a Kelvin lead, which is not it's a Kelvin clip, but it's not a Kelvin four wire setup. And this just goes to a oscilloscope. And this is what the Alley Seller page looks like. Came from this uh, JZDZ store. And there we go. 100 centimeter insulated dual alligator low loss blah 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 free shipping five dollars and this is the last package What does this remind you of? I guess it could be a little balloon, huh? Textured for her comfort. Nipple end. Put these in the same classification as this. The ultimate in sex toys. So this is 20 pieces. It cost me a dollar fifty-nine, uh, two dollars shipping, and their rubber sealing devices for like caulking tubes or glue tubes. You know where you have to cut the end off. So it keeps the, hermetically seals the tube.